finally see you. Your father's been ill. Has he? You didn't tell me that. I thought to myself, she'll come round today and see us, but you didn't. Why is it always up to me to phone you? You can call me as well. Anyway, I'm sure he'll appreciate a visit when you have time. Um, I went to see a counsellor last week. She told me I needed to talk to you. I think Pauline's daughter's counsellor. She said that I have a lot of anger towards you that's stemming from my childhood. Well, I don't know what you are angry about. You had a wonderful childhood. You were always clean, fed. People would comment on how smart you looked. Yeah, but I'm talking about the emotional side of things. You know, like listening to me and encouraging me and being interested in who I am. What are you talking about? You didn't have a clue who you were. You needed guidance. I didn't know who I was. You just didn't like it. You wanted me to be something I'm not. You wanted me to be you. Is that so bad? To make sure you had manners, good morals, not wasting your time on silly things that wouldn't get you anywhere? I need you to be my mum. Not to tell me I can't draw because you didn't want me to do art or saying that I didn't look right. It was constant, every day. I couldn't do anything right. I was just trying to help you. Mum, you're not hearing me. I don't know what to say. I want you to say that you're sorry for making me feel crap about myself. It's really affected me. Hi, how are you? Oh, I'd love that. Yeah, okay, I'll see you shortly. I'm sorry, but I've got to dash off. Norma needs me to help with something, so we'll speak later, yeah? Bye, Mum.